Just over two months ago, a deep-sea oil rig leased by BP exploded in the Gulf of Mexico, unleashing an oil spill which is now one of the worst ecological disasters the world has ever seen. It has put millions of people and wildlife living along vast parts of America's coastline in jeopardy. It has caused an unprecedented cooling of our relationship with the US and is costing BP billions of pounds to fix. But how exactly did this catastrophic event unfold? This is the untold story of the first 36 hours of the disaster. From the moment the rig blew up, the scramble to save the lives of its workers and the desperate attempts to salvage the rig and avoid the cataclysmic damage that followed. The Gulf of Mexico is a vast, oil-rich basin in the Atlantic Ocean that produces over a quarter of America's ever-increasing need for fuel. Forty miles off the coast of Louisiana is the site of semi-submersible oil rig Deepwater Horizon. Shortly after 10 p.m. on the 20th of April, disaster struck the Deepwater Horizon. When it suffered a massive blowout. 126 people are on board. Many are asleep. One of them is rig worker Chris Choi. I heard the first explosion and I set up and got on, set on the edge of the bed, you know, just wondering what it was. Uh, that's when the, the second larger explosion went off. I mean, I just remember being just scared to death. Chris 